Hello again, welcome back to Sir Kinnerath and his ass-kicking ways in Umoria. Um, click into the screen so I have access to this game. Okay. My, uh, whenever I do watch any of these uh, these videos, which I have to do to, to properly edit them, and by edit I don't mean manipulate them in any way, I'm just adding in the title screen, etc. Um, and to make sure I haven't accidentally, you know, sworn so horribly that I have to delete the video or face death by shame. Um, I'm always uh, surprised by how rambling and... Um, <laughs> that's the polite way of saying it, I guess. Uh, and how stream of conscious... Um, let's drop H. Consciousness, my, uh, my thoughts are. So I apologize for that. But indulge me for a moment more, because I just finished watching one of those videos. And uh, the stream of consciousness that's going to spill from my mouth now has to do with DeWitt's many-world theory. Um, a quantum theory as to how the universe works, and that uh, every possible reality exists, and every time something can happen in the universe, it does happen, and a new universe springs into being to support that reality. Um, oops. We just killed that guy with a shovel again. That's this reality. I gotta watch that, because that's a good way to die. Um, but um, it occurred to me, we were talking in the last, the last video, about the fact that it is possible that this is the only form of teleportation, or teleportation, <laughs> uh, not just stream of consciousness, but blatant uh, consciousness based on what I was seeing here. Um, Look to the west. I don't care. Let's scroll teleport. We want that drop. That's our getaway thing. Let's, let's eat the mushroom of minor cures to get a tiny bit of hunger taken care of. All right. Um, we were talking about the idea of what if this is the, the last form of entertainment after an apocalypse, and if DeWitt's many-world theory is correct, then it is undeniable that there is a reality out there in which case, in which all of... Uh, Civilization has come crashing to an end. I guess there are an infinite number of realities out there where all of civilization has come to an end, and these <laughs> these ridiculous, crappy videos are all that survived. Um, that's actually reality somewhere and some when. So, to whoever is existing in that reality, um, a profound apology for the ridiculousness of your situation. And, uh, you know, stay safe out there. Because it's a tough old world in the radiation-filled landscape. I suppose on that note, it's also a an inevitability that there would be a world in which Sir Kinnerath actually exists then. And in which uh, he really is in the mines of Moria trying to kill a Balrog. So this is also a play-by-play -play, uh, excerpt. Uh, or documentary, I guess, of, of an actual event somewhere, somewhere. It's bizarre to think about, and I'm not just talking on my ass here. That's legitimately a prevailing, um, a prevailing uh, dictum of of science, uh, an unproven strain of quantum theory, not necessarily representative of reality, but uh, as far as I've read, it's actually the the most widely believed among even quantum physicists that all of that shit that I just said is actually true. And that's fucked up. So for for the sake of that universe, let's make sure we win this game. So wherever that is happening, uh, the Balrog truly gets defeated. Shit, somebody took some shit out of my backpack. And what did they take? They took our base level spell book, goddammit. Alright. You know what? We're heading back to town. I don't want to walk around in the dark. It's just a good way to get killed. And without all my detection spells... That's just a good way to get killed. Our backpack is basically full. Let's uh, let's head back. Oh, fuck you, brigand. He got something else. Let's kill him off. Die, brigand. Oh, he's getting all kinds of shit. What'd he get? I don't know. We can see that we have less items here. We were down to V before. He got three items in total. I genuinely don't know what... 
Oh well, so be it. Um, let's just wait it out here. He may come back to us. Let's wait until we get pulled back to town and we will go buy that book again, I hope. I hope it's available for sale. Let's start with that so you can hear me scream in rage when it's not. Oh, battle scarred veteran, you are a pathetic thing. I don't want your broken sword, it's literally valueless. Okay, he's got it. Okay. P A. This is the most important thing we needed. Uh, let's, again, not quibble too much because, uh, whoops, I mean to press caps lock. We can't afford to have him throw us out here. We need this book. Good enough. Um, buy some words of recall. We need those. Why are you making me bargain again for them? We know that they're 167 or so. Jesus, just give me the goddamn things. Fine. I don't care that you fixed it at a crappy price. What else are we selling? Alright, let's sell off some of this shit and get back in that dungeon. Ah, 24. Minus 1. Good enough. Sell off. A scroll titled Clis Tito. Clis Tito Fuente. Um, 27. Minus 1. Why did I do that? We know it's going to come to 17. Good enough. A scroll of trap creation. That is a cursed scroll. When you cast that, you end up uh, creating a bunch of traps all around you that you yourself can step on. It's not like traps that the enemy can trigger. Um, I did have a character I think I mentioned. Oh, fuck off ditch this damn thing. Drop. That died as a result of that. He, he um, created a bunch of traps around himself and kept stumbling into them. Confusion traps and summon monster traps and it was his demise. So this guy will never meet his end that way. We are slowly eliminating the things that killed us before. The Umber Hulk killed my best character. The Scroll of Trap Creation killed the second best character. Uh, I, I'm not going to carry the Wand of Trap slash Door Destruction, am I? For the sake of fucking chests. And I don't need two Wands of Lightning Bolt. Let's get rid of this. Uh, let's get rid of the first one. Sorry. The first one, at least we know how many charges it has. And that means we can get more money for it. see what we gave it for, but we gave it for something that, uh, that worked out. Um, wand of Trap Door Creation, I think I'm going to get it. No, I'll keep it. Alright, skip. I may come back there and check in a second, does he have another Ring of Protection plus three? I saw one plus two. Oh, we also have shitty gauntlets now, don't we? We have gauntlets of crap. Magical gauntlets of crap. Does he have, um... Oh, yeah, standard gauntlets. Let's just buy those. Purchase L for 20 plus 4. All right, let's wear them. Wear those gauntlets. Let's step outside and drop the other gauntlets. Drop the crap gauntlets. Step back inside. Sell. Hard leather ring mail. Quite possibly magical, but who cares? We're, again, we're not in trouble in terms of money anymore. So let's just sell it as quickly as we can. Alright. We're done here, right? Nothing to sell in the store. It does make short work of things compared to what it used to be, eh? Die. Restore dexterity we don't need. We do need these enchant weapons to dam and armor and blah blah blah. And identify. 
Lots of things here we can buy. Do we have anything to sell? No, 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 no. We're keeping everything else. Okay, uh, let's purchase the scrolls of identify as many as we can. For 63, that's fine. Purchase J. Enter. Okay. Let's get the scrolls of enchant weapon to dam. Final price is fine with me. Enchant armor. Final price is fine with me. Let's go read those. Hello, phone. Uh, Bastard Sword glows faintly. Read. Enchant armor. My cloak. Okay, my cloak's back to plus one, plus one. I shouldn't have done that yet, actually. I should have gone to store number one and seen if there was a cloak for sale. I'm not even going to bother with light crossbow. My spells are doing fine for now. Unless he's got something. Oh, arrows of fire. That's interesting. 20. I'm sure they'll be back for sale. I think that what that tells us is, yes, his his um, his stock does improve over time. those right now, though. They, they might well be valuable as fuck, but I'm not going to buy them right now. See, he might have had a, a magical cloak. He doesn't, but let's get some rations, I think. One ra set of rations, one uh, flask of oil. Purchase B. Done. Purchase F. Ha! You know how much this is for. We're going to settle on three. Let's get two of those. All right. I think we, we've already sold. Like, that's how fast this trip can be now. Now that we're not, like, frantically trying to make sure we get every single thing out of them that we can. Let's just double check in the store to make sure he didn't have any enchant. I mean, he does have some... Um, oh, we need these, don't we? Purchase K. Done. Oh, we have five of them now. I forgot we already bought them. Um, let's get some of these... Just again, stockpile them, because what if we need them someday and we don't have access? Four forty-nine, fine. All right, we got two of those now. I think that's about it. I think we're we're good to go. Yes, we is. All right. Let's, so I almost went back to the stairs. What do I need to go back to the stairs for? Let's read a scroll. That was a nice quick trip. Read a scroll of Word of Recall. Let's go here and wait. Let's make sure nobody wanders up to us. Okay, P-A-E. Kill that dude. Kill the letter R. Death to R. P-A-A. -A. They're Umber Hulk. Slightly nervous about it still. Zombie. Person. P-A-F. P-A-G. Broadsword. Alright. Let's rest. Umber Hulk is evil. So we can use our spell. We could also use uh, protection from evil. Maybe we should try using that. Maybe that's a better... What are you? Something opened that door. There it is. Let's, let's just... What do we know about it? Is it slow or fast or anything? Do we know anything about it? Normal speed. Worth a good deal. It's actually from a slightly easier level than what we're at. Let's, uh, let's cast it right away. Let's cast protection from evil. Prayer. Prayer book C. We do have the Earthquake spell to test out at some point, too, but let's not do that yet. Let's do Protection from Evil. The Umber Hulk is repelled. The Umber... Whoa, that's pretty fucking sweet. Presumably, that means it attacked me, and it's literally doing no damage. I remember when we first read the descriptor in the, uh, the rules there about... I read it aloud to you, or, or at least described what I had read, about the fact that the Protection from Evil spell um, seemed to... It said it, that it, it lowered the damage you take from 
evil creatures. And I was like, well, by, by how much? Uh, is it, I think I said like 50%, 80%, 5%. Um, the answer appears to be 100%. <laughs> so that spell is... Epic. That's fucking awesome. Let's rest up. And I no longer feel safe from evil. That's fine. Let's, let's cast the uh, spell that um, that all the cool kids are talking about. That's Earthquake. We haven't done it yet. According to what I read, this makes like walls collapse. Maybe I'll get away from the walls in case this affects me. It makes walls collapse and it can hurt things that are around it. I don't know if it's like anything that's on the screen. I don't know how it works. But at the very least, we'll get the... Ooh, that's interesting. We get the experience for having cast it. I don't know if I love that spell. I don't really know what it did. If I killed anything with it, I didn't. I wasn't notified of experience. If I'm watching this video later, I should rewind and see if my experience jumped up right, uh, right after I cast a spell to determine if that's how it works. You'll also note that this region is filled with crap. And this region is not, so maybe it's very localized, like within you know five or six squares of you. I don't know, or maybe it's within the room that you're in if you cast it in a room. I don't know. So these guys truly disenchant. We had that question before. It can gaze to disenchant. It's not worth very much. I can probably kill it quickly. I don't want to run from it because what if it just gazes? I assume that's something you can do at distance. We've done all our detection spells over here. Ebony ant. Creeping gold coins. Our only objective for the next uh, I don't know, 14 minutes or so. That was a nice quick trip to town. Oh, fuck you, I hate brigands. They're evil, though. I wonder if my protection spell would, would keep him from stealing from me. I don't know if that's possible. Let's experiment. Cast. If not, then I'm wasting an attack on him by doing this, but C. Which, which spell? E. His attacks are definitely stopped. Um, I actually want to see if it ever says he tries to steal from me. Well, if he did, it, it repelled him. So there's our new defense against thieving motherfuckers. Didn't get my spell books. Again, I just don't recall enough what I was. Maybe he got a scroll of phase door. I think I had four of them, didn't I? That's my best bet. Best guess is he got a scroll of phase door from me. Which he's welcome to. Those are not very valuable. We might even uh, you know, start selling them off soon. If, if scrolls of teleport become available in the stores, if that happens, it casts a spell on a blind. I don't think you can pray while you're blind. So I, can't, I don't have like a prayer of restore blindness. If I still had the slime mold juice, I think that would work. I don't think I have anything else that will help me. Let's assume it was to the north. It magically summons a monster. I'm getting hungry. I'm hungry blind. Yeah, it was to the north. I knew we were standing in front of a... Uh... Fuck, I don't know what the hell's going on now, though. I'm gonna... It bites me. I attacked in the northeast. I killed it. Probably the thing it summoned. I knew I was standing in front of the hallway, so I figured it must have been up there. All right. Rations of food. We're fine. A mace. Slightly valuable weapon. I think my very... That, um, that level 20... Paladin that got killed by the Umber Hulk. Previous to this, my best character ever was incidentally the first Paladin I ever played. The first non-mage character I ever played in this particular game. I, like I said, I've played Rangers, I've played well, maybe that's it. Rangers, Mages, Paladins, and Warriors. But that that's including when I was playing with Angband before. In this game, I've only played Paladins and Mages. I chose to play a Mage repeatedly at first because uh I think an elf mage, probably a female elf mage, because that guy in 30 minutes of Umoria was playing an elf mage, and I was thinking, well, he was successful with it, I'll try that. But as you may have seen from my high score list, I was never effective with a mage. <laughs> Paladins are more my speed. I like to be able to hit things over the head with heavy objects. That's that's what gaming's all about, right? There's a trap there. PAG again. Rest. Nothing evil coming up. Give this game another 10 minutes or so. Oh, fuck me. Do we still have that wand? We do. I don't have to use it, though. I'm not going to. Let's see what it is, though. I'll save that wand 
of trap destruction solely for um, you know uh, chests when I, when there's no other viable means for me to get at the contents without you know smashing the chests. You can apparently, by the way, use F to force chests, which will not only uh, potentially pick the lock but uh, also um, well, I guess that's all it'll do. Actually, that's one way to open the the chest. But in the, these are evil, but I don't care. I'm not afraid of it. Um, in the event that you do smash open the chest, you uh, you can trigger the trap, but you can also um, destroy the contents of the chest. So not the best means of uh, oh fuck me. There's a ghost right behind me. I'm not going to use my detection spells anymore right here. What if we use our protection from evil spell? All right, we are protected from evil. Let's go deal with it. Come back here, you bastard. Got it. All right. That is our new best method of dealing with um, with these guys as well. We have a new hairy mold. Didn't we have a hairy plaid mold before? Oh, a hairy mold of magic major cures. Maybe that's what it was. Equivalent of your major cure thing. I remember uh, when I ate that, it gave me the... I think I've already done my detection spell. There's nothing there. When I ate that mold way back when, um, when I had a spare moment in combat, it uh, it told me, hey, you feel way better or something. You, you feel seriously better or something. But it only healed like 20 health. So it's not that big a deal. Way better at this stage for me is, you know, you give me back 75 health and then I'll feel way better. 20 health is... I wipe my my nose with 20 health. Again, any experienced Angband player will be watching this and saying, you are in greater danger than you think. 153 hit points is nothing. And they're right, I'm sure, but... Let's rest, actually, first. P-A-A. P-A-F-P-A-G. Rest. Uh, we didn't... Uh, we did lose our concentration. That's PAF again, damn it. Rest. You gotta type those messages in a little bit slowly, or you might miss the message that you. Oh, that door just opened. That you failed to cast a spell, and thereby um, might blissfully walk along thinking, hey, I cast a uh, detect traps, I'm safe. And meanwhile, you did not. wand. Another one of those. Again, I, I'm sure I've cast it here, but I'll at least cast PAF. Just to double down. It misses you. It's not an evil. Something is biting me and stinging me. We've seen a few of those invisible things biting me and stinging me. I, w I wish I knew what they were, just for... I don't know, just for completionist. The completionist in me wants to know the full beast area of this game. I guess I could probably look it up. I won't do that until I'm done, though. I don't want to get spoilers. Um, if I can avoid it. But I wish it, I wish there was a way for me to tell. And again, if I ever do get sense invisible, how close are we to leveling up and presumably getting that? We're getting close now. Maybe in the next six minutes? Maybe. It's a tall order. Probably not. What are you? Before I blindly walk up to you. Oh, I'm glad I did not do that. Let me PCB you. Boom. Envelop several creatures. Do you see that? So that's an area effect spell. I didn't know that. Let's wait here for the killer green beetle. Oh, and an earth spirit too. Fuck. It's dead. Let's kill the beetle. We've killed these before. I don't think we're in any grave danger. Let's rest up fully. And let's blast that son of a bitch with PCB again. Good to know that that's... Um, how, how's my failure rate on that? 
Uh, 35%, not terrible. Um, good to know that that's uh, an area effect weapon. I didn't know that. It doesn't mention that in the, uh, again, in the rule books or anything. It's, uh, I think whoever writes the manuals, again, that's a simple fix, guys. Even if you're not modding the game, we don't want that. You could mod the, I don't think I want that. Um, you could mod the freaking rule book. You know, you take two minutes to fix it. Incidentally, I mentioned the fact that the uh, Caverns is coming out again soon when I finish up the last religion. I also have to update the rule books, obviously, both the uh, the full document, the full manual, and the, uh, the quick readme in case anybody is too impatient to read the rule book. Um, they'll have that. But I need to make sure that both of them have all the information about religion, etc. Also, incidentally, um, although religion is undeniably the the major feature that's been added in between you know the last game and and last game release whoops and the the soon to be most recent um it's not the only thing there's been a million bug fixes and uh, and a lot of smaller features you know new magic items new spells um and other like i said there's a morale system now and other other features such as that there's been a lot of improvements ui improvements and blah 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 so it has been two years. Um, it's not going to be two years worth of uh, improvements in terms of, you know, by comparison to the speed I used to work at at any rate. Whoa, what are you? I'm going to guess a spider. I've never seen, or, or else a big snake? Maybe a giant snake? Let's see. Giant brown scorpion. I've never seen that before. All right, let's kill it. I'm going to guess it can poison me if it stings me is my guess. But it's not going to get a chance. Giant white dragonfly, we know they can frost us up. But it's not going to get a chance to do that either. Alright. I don't remember which spell... I was, I was in the midst of casting spells, and I don't recall which ones I completed. So let's do the full run of spells again. There we go. Didn't... Uh, I wasn't also looking. Let's make sure we didn't... Uh, nope. Didn't get a... Lost your concentration memo. That we ignored. All right, another two and a half minutes. We will call this complete, unless we are on the verge of leveling up. I'll check at that point. When we hit the 30-minute mark, I will check. If we level up before the 30-minute mark, we'll call it quits there. Otherwise, at the 30-minute mark, I'll check, and unless we're very close, we will uh, we'll call it a call it a done video. We are getting there, though. Again, my my confidence uh, my confidence level feels higher than probably it should. Because we're in territory where I'm fighting monsters I've never seen before, but I'm, I'm dealing with them, I'm killing them. And, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're doing quite well in terms of, uh, what is this guy? Is it a purple guy so I can, you know, learn about it? No, I'll just kill it for the sake of killing it. Let's kill it for violence's sake. There's a way to go here. My light's growing faint. Yeah, I'm, I'm starting to think there's a... Although the, the, the possibility remains thin, I'm at least entertaining the theoretical notion that we may actually win this game. But, you know, let's not get our hopes too high. I find even in Caverns, which is, you know, it's my own game, I should, I should be good at beating it. I beat it maybe one out of every 400 times I play. It's a very, very difficult game to beat, but uh, it's got so much content that I find it's fun to play constantly anyway. Um, Hope I've cast spells. It stung me and I didn't get poisoned, but that could just be a, it's like a percent chance it poisons you when it stings you. I should have done a recall on it, because we have information on it now, right? Let's go until we advance the screen by one. Um, even in that game, which I, I win seldom, there are times when it's like I'm doing so well and I'm like, okay, this time I think I'm going to win. I usually go tell my wife, hey, you might want to come see this. I'm like, I think I'm going to win this time. And then inevitably something terrible happens, or I do something stupid, and I die. Now, given I'm probably better at that game, well, I don't want that anyway. Probably better at that game than I am at this game. Although that game may be harder, I don't know. I have beaten it, though. I've beaten that game three times, three or four times. Caverns is Escazian, too. Um, I don't want any of that anyway. Yeah, given... Uh, Given how often I think, hey, I'm going to win, and then it, you know the universe pulls the rug out from under me, 
in this universe at any rate. Maybe there's an alternate universe where I did win, right? Let's check. We're at the 30 minute mark. Let's check our character. Oh, fuck me. We're like 93 points or something like that. We could uh, surely get 93 experience points in the next few minutes. We will be done here in, in mere moments. Rest assured. If you're just about to sit down comfortably, don't. We're about to get up and be done with this video. If you haven't taken your shoes off yet, don't bother. We're done. Any moment. A lot of rubble over here, eh? Ah, scroll of enchanted armor. I can't carry that. Well, I'm carrying that. I'm going to drop my mace, pick it up, read it. My large metal shield grows faintly. Yes, glows. I often say grows. Um, come on, man. As as awesome as that was, we want to. Okay, there's a ton of monsters over here. Minotaur. I think in Angban that's our Hydra, probably because that's supposed to be like two heads. I don't know what it is, but it's evil. Our protection from evil spells, our new best friend. Um, let's P-A-F. P-A-G. Bear with me while I head over to that room. And we'll see what that is. and If whatever it is kills me. <laughs> and I'll, actually, I'll, I'll be grateful that I did continue playing, or else there would have been a, a final one-minute video where it kills me. Oops, I was using the wrong weapon there. I killed a giant fly with... Whatever that was. Skeleton human, I can deal with you. You're not frightening to me. Let's go f at least find that M. Let's rest for the sake of a few hit points. Because we don't know what that M is. Staff of Darkness, I don't want. I think it was up over here. I'm a little nervous. Not gonna lie. Black Beetle, I don't think we've seen this before, have we? Yeah, I know I'm on an open door. What is it? New monster. We never fought a killer black beetle. Let's hope it's not that tough. So we are going over our time limit for a minute here to try and deal with this. Alright, I killed it. There's a breeder there. Let's back away in case the breeders are going to breed. Let's rest. We still want to get that M. Find out what it is. All right, we're back. We're back, baby. There it is. What is it? A mummified kobold. I know nothing about it. The only thing I do know is I'm terrified. Let's uh, let's see how fast it is. It's as fast as I am, damn it. No, maybe not. Let's cast Protection from Evil. C. Which spell? Protection from Evil. I lost my concentration. I'm not fighting that thing without it. Berg, back the fuck off. Fuck me. Um, P, B, B. We teleported into a scary place. All right, we are gonna call it here. We know what the mummified thing is. It's a mummified kobold. Hopefully, I won't forget it's over there when I come back. Can I, should I, maybe I should rest really quickly. This is an interesting vault we teleported into. We can rest, okay. Let's actually try and deal with it quickly. <laughs> My wife just texted me that she is eating yogurt wherever she is. Um, and our cats are yogurt crazy. So she, uh, she just said that uh, it's weird without two furry sharks circling her. Because normally they would be pestering her for for handouts of yogurt. Oh, fuck. I don't want to waste time with this. I need to drop something. Level 22, we did it. This is a Ring of Resist Cold. Fuck. Gain new spells. Sense Invisible. Nice. Red Nag, I can drain my shit. It's evil, though. Let's do our protection from evil. C. E. Fuck you, we lost your concentration. All right, it's dead. We want this ring really quickly. I'm sorry, we are going over. Drop V. I'm just afraid I'll... I'll I don't know if I have time to play again today, so I'll forget when I come back that we were dealing with that kobold. Um, rest. P-A-A. -A. I don't know where it is. It's gone-ish. All right, you know what? 
not fair to you. We're done. That's 35 minutes. Um, hopefully next time we'll deal with that kobold and a hobgoblin up here if you're watching, Jeff. Kobold somewhere over here if you watch this video before you play. To the east, there's a kobold, mummy, hobgoblin up here, and something else up here I wasn't paying enough attention to. All right. Peace out, guys. Have a good one. Let's see how we're doing, by the way. Yeah. Bye.